Hi, I'm Naveen Nilakantam. I'm a software engineer. Hi, I'm Kunal Kapoor, product manager at Pure. So what we're going to talk today about is the hybrid world that our customers live in. Uh, our customers have a lot of stuff on-prem uh, and love the flash array that they are consuming on-prem, but they are trying to now leverage the public cloud for many different use cases. And obviously there's challenges there. So one of the challenges, Naveen, a lot of our customers have told us about is, how can I use the cloud for secondary storage? How can Pure help there? Yeah, that's a great question. Our customers are familiar with the snapshot capabilities of our flash array on-prem. You have instant snapshots, you can maintain them on a retention policy that you set. And what we've essentially done is added a new product called CloudSnap that lets you take a object store from the public cloud in this case, an S3 bucket, and associate that with your flash array. And so those snapshots can just move to, they can be offloaded essentially into the public cloud, into that bucket. And if you at some later point want to bring that snapshot back, you can restore it onto a flash array, the original flash array that's sent to the snapshot okay. or to really any other flash array that you have. So that's perfect. You know, From a backup perspective and using the cloud for backup, we have that solved. So, but our customers throw a bigger challenge. I need to move my applications there and actually run my applications there. So when you look at the cloud and on-prem, the resiliency availability features are so different. On-prem, you know, the apps really depend on the storage layer for Absolutely. all of that feature set. But in the cloud, you don't have that. You don't have thin provisioning or DD for compression in the cloud. So now when customers are faced with that challenge of how do I run my app that is running on-prem in the cloud, how can Pure really help there too? Yeah, so we're gonna help with that part of it as well. So we're We're going to take the software that runs on-prem on our flash arrays, and we've essentially taken that to the public cloud and created a product that we call Cloud Block Store. So it's essentially the same flash array that you're familiar with on-prem. It's running in the public cloud. It has the, really the same feature set. It looks and feels the same, and it has all of the same API. So we're trying to solve that uh, tier one storage capabilities that you've come to expect on-prem. We're going to provide you that, that for you in the cloud using Cloud Block Store. Thanks, Naveen. That was great. So the Cloud Block Store gives all the awesome capabilities that our customers have come to expect on the Flash Array on-prem. Now you have all of those capabilities in the cloud. That's great. So I'm thinking of a few use cases that does enable for our customer. But can you walk me through all the different use cases our customers can use this capability for? Yeah, absolutely. So first of all, Cloud Block Store enables you to asynchronously replicate uh, data from an on-prem Flash Array So you can uh, have access to the same data in the cloud that you have on-prem. Mm -hmm. So in the case, you can use that for disaster recovery. So in the case of a disaster, your data has always been replicating into the cloud. You can easily spin up that volume uh, and it's now accessible for your applications yep. and you, you can recover. That's true. Uh, similarly, you can use that for test and dev. You know, the data that you have created on-prem, you can access it in the cloud and use the instant spin up capabilities that the cloud provides you to uh, develop on that data or, or run test environments against it. Uh, and similarly, you can migrate. You know, you can, we help you get the data over there. And now your application uh, can access the same data. You can bring down your application on-prem yep. and uh, run it in the cloud. And of course, if you use CloudSnap to yep. uh, get data into the cloud, we will support restoring that data into a cloud block store. And that's another way that you can make the data available. That's awesome. So this looks like from a data mobility standpoint, we have it solved. With Cloud Snap, with async replication to Cloud Block Store, we have the data in the cloud. But if I'm a customer and I'm thinking about, I have an application running on-prem, I need to spin that application up in the cloud. How am I going to do that? So is Pure going to be able to help with that too? Absolutely. For our VMware customers uh, running on-prem, we're going to provide VR vRealize automation so that you can take an application running on-prem. The data is already there in Cloud Black Store via mm -hmm. the mechanisms we've talked about before. And it makes it very easy for you to seamlessly move that application into the public cloud. So let's say you're running a database in VMware on-prem, uh, through vRealize automation, you can bring that same database up running in the public cloud. That's great. Similarly, with our Pure Service Orchestrator product, which is for containerized applications, whether you're using Docker or Kubernetes, uh, that makes it very easy to use the Flash Array for those types of applications. And Pure Service Orchestrator is going to run uh, 
just the same as it does on-prem uh, on top of Cloud Block Store. And so that same application that ran on-prem can run in the cloud uh, very easily. That's perfect. So really, I mean, we've solved the data mobility problem. We've helped a lot on the application mobility space too. But now when I look at this picture, this is the hybrid world our customers live in. So there's on-prem, there's cloud. What about manageability? Is this all managed as silos that our customers now have to figure out or can help Pure help there too? Of course, so Pure is all about simplicity. So Pure One will also be that single pane of glass for both your on-prem environment and your cloud environment. So you can really access all of these uh, resources that Pure provides and products all from one, uh, one interface. Actually, that's great because Pure One, with all the uh, manageability features that it has now, it really has enabled your hybrid world to be managed to this single pane of glass. Everything that you've come to love about Pure One on-prem, you have that for your cloud block store, for cloud snap, that's great. So this looks like we've solved a lot of problems, but we're just getting started. We've got a lot more coming. There's a lot more features, automation that we can add that really helps customers in the cloud journey that they are on. So guys, stay tuned. There's gonna be a lot more coming from Pure around all of these cloud features and automation and orchestration. Um, stay tuned for great features that we'll be announcing soon. Thank you. Thanks to me. Thanks, Carl.